This is Jilu Rahman from Bangladesh, student in the IIUM, International Islamic University, Malaysia. This uh, Muslim university, then a uh, lot of scholars come here and for higher study. Here accommodations and food, communications, everything is awesome. I like it very much. And the uh, IIUM, food quality is very good. And uh, here Nasi Lama and uh, Nasi Bute. Nasi goreng, I like it very much. Here uh, local some students and uh, uh, teachers, they make this awesome food. Sometimes they cooperate us their uh, local food. They are serendang, we love it. Thank you very much. Hello everyone, my name is Yoshitaka Usaki and I'm a student at Monash University, Malaysia. First of all, when you travel to Malaysia, you will need to go to a Malaysia embassy in Tokyo to obtain a single entry visa. And remember to download the My Signature apps to your smartphone before your flight. On the day of my departure to Malaysia, the check-in process takes longer than usual, so make sure you arrive at the airport earlier than usual. On arrival in Malaysia, it takes approximately 3-4 to four hours to reach your quarantine hotel. The room was very clean and had a good Wi-Fi connection. The food provided is also good. On the day I was released from the quarantine, a driver arranged by the university picked me up from the hotel to my condominiums. Hi, my name is Yu Hongshi from China. Currently, I'm doing my internship in Malaysia and also I've been in Malaysia for almost three years. English is widely spoken in Malaysia, so it's good for international students and also help me improve my English. Malaysia tuition fee is really affordable. After graduation, I can receive dual degree from local university, the other from UK, US or Australia. Here is close to Singapore and Thailand. Fly from Malaysia to other places like one hour or two hours, which is kind of like saving you a lot of time. Living cost is kind of lower compared to other Western countries. Studying Malaysia literally teach me a lot, like how to live independent, how to take care of myself. Hello guys, good day to you all. Welcome again to EMGS Course Talk series. In the next five minutes, we will be uncovering some of the courses and program details with the guests of the day. So stay tuned with us until the end of the program. Feel free to raise any questions throughout the session. Our team will attend to the question as soon as possible. Before that, please click the like button on our Facebook page and follow our social media to get the latest updates about study in Malaysia. Today, we have a special guest from UCSI University. Associate Professor Dr. Alan Q. He is the Director of Institute of Computer Science and Digital Innovation at UCSI University. Now, Dr. Alan will share with us about Bachelor of Computer Science, Honors, Mobile Computing and Networking Program at UCSI University. Welcome, Dr. Alan. How are you doing today? I'm fine, thank you. How are you? I'm good, thank you. That's great. 
let's just let's get right into the questions. So, what makes Bachelor of Computer Science Honors Program uh, Mobile Computing and Networking from uh, at UCSI so special from others? Morning. Uh, at under Institute of Computer Science and Digital Technologies, we have a lot of programs uh, ranging from foundation diploma, degree, and recently we have a PhD in computer science just recently launched. Uh, among the programs that we have under ICSDI, the, 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 the Bachelor of Computer Science, Mobile Computing, and Networking are, uh, I can say, the entrenched uh, demand from our students because of a few reasons. The first reason is we have the latest pedagogy, the teaching pedagogy that we teach to our students, equip them to become innovators and also entrepreneurial. Uh, as um, under ICSDI, we provide a business incubation hub for development of prototype and commercialization. Therefore, with the latest uh, teaching pedagogy, students are able to link what they have learned to the practical. That is the first uh, unique point. The second unique point that we have under this program is that uh, what we call it as an industry relevancy. We have a, a lot of certification that we offer to our students. One of the certification is uh, we have just signed an MOU with Alibaba Academic, uh, where our students is able to attend and be certified. Uh, and the certification is worth 120 USD free of charge. So uh, before even the students are graduated, they are already been certified uh, for example, as the cloud computing certified under Alibaba. So this is the second unique point of our program. The third unique point is our students are equipped or they'll be trained to be what we call it as a high skill students. Uh, because over the past few years, the, the, the human quality, the human skills is very important. So our programs are designed to teach and mentor our students with the latest technologies, with the latest knowledge, that able to help and to contribute to the industry relevancy. So these are the three unique features at uh, under ICSDI for the program. Thank you. I see. Okay. So uh, for international students uh, in this particular program, are uh, mostly from which country? Uh, we our, our our students. Uh, we have thirty percent. Thirty percent of our students at UCSI are international students. Under this program. Uh, most of our international students comes from countries such as China, Bangladesh, Pakistan, and Myanmar. I see. Okay. So, can you share with us some success stories or graduate employment from this program? Like, are there any successful alumni who have worked in the industry? Okay. Thank you. We we have we have a number. We have a lot. In fact, our students who graduated and then exceed very well in the industry. I would just like to share two uh, examples. One of the students is called Shin Nelin. She's graduated in uh, year 2016, first class honor. And she has actually been offered as a scholarship to study Master of Computer Science from University of College Cork in Ireland. And the project that she has undertaken there is called the Apple Ecosystem in Healthcare. So currently she's working as a software engineer at LM Ericsson in Ireland. This is one of the example. The second example is, is uh, Zafira Rashid. Uh, she's also graduated uh, year 2016, first class honor. And currently, uh, he's the SIP consultant in Kuala Lumpur, which provides the consulting service to migrate uh, cloud solutions under the client company. Yeah, these are some of the examples that our students, once they've graduated, uh, they're able to be placed and also to succeed in their workplace. And for your information, UCSI universities, we have 100% of graduate employability under our program. I see. I was going to get to that. So uh, I may I know like the overall percentage rate for graduate on time for students who have been in this program? The minimum we have is uh, at least minimum 90% for graduate on time. Okay. Yes. So, uh, thank you so much, Dr. Allen, for joining us today and sharing such valuable insights about Bachelor of Computer Science, Honors, Mobile Computing and Networking Program at UCSI University. So students, for any inquiries, you may drop me an email at azlina at educationmalaysia.gov.my or send us a message on our Facebook page. All right, before we end the session, let's hear a message from EMGS CEO, Mr. Muhammad Razan Jalaluddin. With that, I hope to see you again in the next course talk series. Stay tuned, guys. Bye-bye.
Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh Hi and welcome to our students I'm Muhammad Razlan bin Jalaluddin from Education Malaysia Global Services Thank you for joining EMGS Cross Talk Series Malaysia is definitely the best choice for you to pursue your studies regardless of programs or level of studies Our quality of education is well recognised globally The cost of living here is reasonable too Malaysia is a beautiful country that is strategically located in the heart of Asia. You can experience a dynamic lifestyle with exciting adventures and places to explore. In addition, our cultural diversities make us unique. Moreover, your safety and well-being are our utmost priority as Malaysia is currently ranked 20th in the 2020 Global Peace Index Report. These reasons make Malaysia very unique and should be your preferred destination to further your studies. Rest assured, you will experience an education journey unlike any other. We welcome you with open arms and hope to see you soon in Malaysia. Welcome to Malaysia. Selamat datang ke Malaysia.